The county executive did a good job balancing the resources we have available with his funding priorities, which for the most part are consistent with the decisions the county council will make. However, the county council also has priorities of its own, and we are going to be working to find room in the budget for vitally important programs such as the Public Election Campaign Fund. Last year, Montgomery County made a landmark decision to take special interest money out of our elections for county executive and county council. What we see now is that citizens figure that the campaigns are funded by big money and they don't want to participate. I believe passage of this bill would actually make it easier for people to know that candidates are dependent on small contributions and that they're comfortable opening up their checkbook. If you the first the year policy. that this will take effect is the election of 2018. Between now and then, we have to set aside funds so that the public election campaign fund is up and running in time for the next election. A second very important priority for me is that Montgomery County is working with President Obama to end homelessness among our veteran population. No one who has served our country should be sleeping on the street. In the last one day count of our homeless population, 24 veterans were recorded as homeless. The federal government has been very helpful in providing veterans assisted supportive housing vouchers to house veterans and we expect to get more this year but we will need to add some county funds if we are going to meet President Obama's commitment to end veterans homelessness in 2015. We will need to add funds to the county executive's budget to work towards that goal.